Hi everyone, I'm Rupa Dasher, founder of ThriveWise. I started ThriveWise, formerly known as CodeChix, after years of working in tech because I wanted to connect with like-minded technical women, share experiences and knowledge, and keep up my technical skills. Um, so engineers should actually meet some human. <laughs> Not only do I get to meet a whole bunch of really extraordinary women who are working in tech, so it gives me this connection that I really don't have um, in, in other tech venues that I come to. Decision making at the most senior levels of many organizations are really still made like they were 100 years ago, based on who has the best story, who has kind of the most dominance in the room, and let's be honest, you know, often it's the tall person or the male person yes. Yes. who <laughs> ends up prevailing. Somebody throws a negative bias to you, how do you respond? You can wait for the world to change, but really how you respond to it, it is in under your control. And my thesis is don't engage with bias. When you don't engage with bias, you don't give credence to the bias and you just walk away. As you grow in your career, your your impact and, and support for your promotion process comes from a wider range of people. So people need to understand that making decisions is important. Making decisions that is aligned with the rest of the groups that are involved in the products is equally important, if not more. So I'll let you in on a little secret. People are always asking me, who are your best mentors? And some of my most effective mentors probably have no idea that they actually are my mentor because they're people that I have observed are really great at something that I want to develop better in myself. And instead of going and asking them, will you be my mentor, which can sometimes uh, place a heavy burden on the person that you're asking, yep. uh, instead, I'll go observe them and then sometimes I'll go and ask them for very specific feedback. Whether you've built a plane or what I've experienced, whether you've won an Oscar or whether you are a tenured faculty member, your needs and wants are the same. You want your technology to do the same thing. You want it to work. And when we are dealing with these people, the same methods that we approach and how we deal with our clients and our customers apply. So the work is the work. And it's pretty amazing work. I do really like it. And understanding how to manage work-life balance, and I'm blown away. <laughs> this is amazing.